if you're looking to try and make a disruptive change, uh, you know, trying to do 10% better than other people isn't going to get it. Uh, what you really need to do to really uh, break into an industry and create a revolution is what we call moonshot thinking, which is really a 10x change, uh, going 10 times bigger versus 10% bigger. So when it forces you, when you do that, it forces you to think at a totally different scale. And it means you're not going to actually try and, you know, reinvent an industry. You're going to start with a clean sheet of paper. So you can imagine if the uh, hotel industry, Hilton and Hyatt and Intercontinental, had asked the question, how do we increase the number of rooms we have uh, 10x without spending any money? Most people would have said, that's crazy, can't be done. Of course, you can do it. That's what Airbnb did. And so it really, uh, moonshot thinking is, is thinking in a completely disruptive, crazy fashion and realizing that the day before something is truly a breakthrough, it's a crazy idea. So when we talk about moonshot thinking, what we're talking about is aiming big, solving a problem that matters, that matters to you, that matters to people that work to you, and that matters to customers. Uh, and sometimes that's the really big, really hard problems are the ones that there's more of a market for if you actually solve it. It was General Patton in World War II who said, if the problem's too small, try making it bigger. Because the biggest problems are the ones that your customers will feel most passionate about if you solve them, and that you'll have employees who are passionate about and want to be part of. I think we all believe that there are noble challenges that are so important that they require uh, not a singular effort to deliver on the promise, but a community effort. And so we often refer to that as a moonshot, where, where you want to engage and enlist experts and, uh, and talent from many different disciplines in order to get to the, the, end, the end result as quickly and as efficiently as possible. And so I think moonshot thinking is the best way to make a quantum advance in any technological field. Moonshot thinking or extreme uh, risk taking is something that's um, uh, instrumental when it comes to future foresight. And for us, when it comes to talking about uh, moonshot uh, thinking at the Dubai Future Foundation, uh, it's music to our ears because we look at uh, uh, different individuals that really talk about uh, far-fetched ideas, ideas that require a lot of risk taking, ideas, like you mentioned, that are moonshot driven. And uh, obviously, Dr. Demandis is one of the uh, leading moonshot leaders uh, that talks about future foresight and, and uh, what it takes really to, to, to be someone that comes up with extremely uh, risky, yet extremely beneficial ideas for humanity.